Welcome to the Earn Your Happy Podcast. I'm Lori Harder, founder of The Bliss Project, three-time fitness world champion, fitness expert, and cover model turned self-love junkie, lifestyle entrepreneur, and author. Each week, I'll bring you a guest or a thought that will help you bust through your fears, connect to your soul, and get focused and clear so you can elevate your life, business, and relationships. We don't wait until we're ready for someone to tell us we're good enough. We take what we want and we anoint ourselves. Get ready to earn, own, and unapologetically rock your happiness every single day. Are you with me? Here we go. Welcome back to the Earn Your Happy Podcast. And you guys, if you are feeling isolated, if you're feeling like you don't have a tribe of women, like-minded people to really help you transcend from where you are right now into the person that you know you are being called to be, or maybe you're getting that soul calling and you're not quite answering it yet and it's turning more into a scream and it's starting to make you feel even more awful than the thought of facing the fear around doing that actual thing. If you're in any of these positions, you have to join me this year at The Bliss Project. It is March 2nd through the 4th in Newport Beach, California, and it is going to be a life changing weekend. If you've been wanting to bust through your fears and really meet a like minded tribe of people, this is exactly where you must be. If you're feeling called to this, I want you to go check it out at theblissproject.info right now. It's also in the show notes. And who is this event for? You guys, I really want to get clear on if you're feeling called to it. I want to make sure that you know what is going to go on there. So if you have always had a desire to do something big, but you've always been afraid to follow through, if you feel like you don't have the tools or the expertise to take the next step, if you wish you had that tribe of supportive people, if you're ready to take that next step into the next level, but you have no idea what that's even supposed to look like, or if you just want to feel more fully alive each day. And this is absolutely for you if you want a deeper connection and understanding in your relationships, if you want to become more fulfilled in your own job that you have right now and in daily tasks, if you want to know the true desires of your soul. And if you're ready to enjoy the journey just as much as the destination. And truly, if you are feeling called to expand your spiritual connection, we're going to be doing some incredible exercises, meditations. We have some awesome teachers who are going to come in and really give you the space to understand what that feels like for you. Because for everyone, it's so different. But to be able to do it together uh, makes you feel even more connected than you've ever felt before. So if you're interested in meditation, if you want to create a solid foundation for all of your goals and dreams to be built on, or if you just need a mental reset, a confidence booster, and to really own your own personal power, you guys, this is the place that you want to be. So there are still some tickets left, but they sell out fast. You guys in this year will be the best bliss project that we've ever done. We have a really amazing team working on it. And we're adding so many more things than we have ever done in prior years, because I know that when I get the opportunity to put epic women into a room. I want magical things there so that you guys can truly have the tools to create your own amazing transformation and experiences. And you guys, what happens there is nothing short of miraculous. So if you're ready to create your transformation, if you're ready to step in, if you're ready to have your tribe, this is where you want to be. And I hope that you join us and that I get to meet you and hug you and see you there. So theblissproject.info. Welcome back to the Earn Your Happy Podcast. And it is time for another quickie because there's always time to fit an inspiration. And coming up on the new year, you guys, there's going to be so much talk about goals and smashing through your 2018 goals and everything that you want to do and all of your accomplishments. And what happens is it can feel so insanely exciting 
but also so incredibly overwhelming. And we know what typically ends up happening to like 99% of the population every single year. And that is that they fall off by the end of January of their goals because it was that all or nothing mentality. So something that I want to tell you before um, I will do some more podcasts on this in the new year for sure on manifesting your dreams and how to reach your goals. Uh, That's something I definitely want to cover with you guys. So stay tuned for that so that you can have step by step. But what I want you to focus on right now, because right now you are in the holidays, you're in the thick of it if you're listening to this, or maybe you're just coming out of it. And it's not so much about the how. It is about following and knowing what you desire, just getting really clear on what it is that you desire and how you want to feel in this next year. So it's not so much on the how. Sometimes we get so caught up in, I need to do this. I have to be on this health program. I have to be enrolled in this. I need to make sure I get this certification. I got to go to this event. I need to make sure this program is out. And we can get so caught up in thinking that we have so much to do when really it's just really getting so clear on what those one or two goals are and making sure that they are in alignment with how we actually want to feel this next year. Because if we are making those goals set on maybe financial goals or set on what we think we should do, we are probably going to miss the mark because we're going to lose that initial energy, that initial flame that comes with the fact of being in alignment with what it is that you are desiring. So you guys, some things that you can start doing right now are just sitting for like five minutes in the morning and asking yourself what it is that would bring you the most joy to be able to do or to be able to be of service to other people. What does that look like to be in service to people in a way that brings you the most joy that you can possibly think of? And Typically, that is where you want to start focusing all of your energy around because a lot of times when I have focused in the past around things that are not bringing me joy because I'm doing them for financial reasons, I create some blocks there. Or maybe you already have a program that's spectacular, but you're thinking that you need to do more things Uh, because it's not bringing you the income that you want. And maybe you just need to rekindle that program. That just happened to me recently is this last year was spent focusing on rekindling my excitement and joy around my body and soul program because it was a great program, except I wanted it to be doing more. I wanted to be having more members. I wanted to be attracting a much bigger tribe. So I thought, well, if it's not attracting this much bigger tribe that I'm desiring, then maybe I just need a new program. Maybe it's this thing over here. Maybe it's that thing. And I really sat down and I went over it uh, with some amazing coaching uh, some from my husband and from a very close, incredible business friend. And it was really learning to get so refocused, reframe something that is already amazing and really putting all of my energy and focus into making something that's already great into something incredible. So when I did that, when I took my energy off from thinking that it needed to be all of these other things and realized I already have a thing that is spectacular And if I just focus on it and if I send it attention, if I send it love, if I get really grateful for the people that I already have, then I'm going to be manifesting more of what I want because I'm grateful for what I have and my focus is being shifted because we know what we focus on, we get more of. And I was, I was focusing externally, right? I'm like, what I don't have, I want these people who aren't here yet. Why aren't they here yet? Do I need another program? What's going on? So I was getting more lack. I was, I was feeling like I was burning out. I was feeling like I was just spinning my wheels and I was getting nowhere. So you guys don't focus so much on what you don't have, right? So 
focus on what you do want. So right now, before you even set those New Year's goals, maybe you already have them. I know you guys are all a bunch of overachievers and I love that about you. (laughs) So maybe you do already have them. But if you don't, or if you're just going to enjoy this next week uh, during the holidays, what you can still do is just start to really picture what it is that you want to feel in the new year. How do you want to feel that way and how can you be of service and still have that feeling, be of highest service, fulfilling your highest potential. And that is the alignment that you want to get in. And that is the energy that is going to create more finances. It's going to bring more people. You're going to bring more impact to the world because you are following that soul's calling and not focusing exactly on the how. And then once you do that, you have to look, right? We have to start looking for the clues every single day that that is the alignment that we are meant to be in. So you guys, I hope this helps you. And for now, just enjoy this incredible season. Give your loved ones an extra hug. Know that I am giving you the most giant bear hug in the world right now because I am just completely grateful that I get to serve in a way that I love. That's how this podcast started. I didn't even think about the how. I thought of how I wanted to feel instead of thinking of how will people start listening. I was like, how can I add value and feel the way that I want to feel? I want to feel like I'm having conversations with the people that I love, right? I want to feel like I'm having these epic conversations about topics that actually matter and that people are here them who actually care. And that's how this began. And that's how the people showed up. It's like I focused on what I wanted to feel and what I wanted to give and how I wanted to feel while I was giving. And then all of a sudden the audience showed up. That's how it works, you guys. That's how it works when you are in your highest potential and your highest alignment. I hope that you are getting excited. I hope that you are getting breakthroughs even while listening to this. I hope that you're getting like those pops of popcorn, like this is what I could do. This feels good. Oh my God, don't lose that because that's the thing. That's the stuff, those moments, right? Those kernels, those popping moments where you're like, yes, that's it. That soul hit is what I call it. So Now, what's going to happen after you get the soul hit? It's going to fizzle just a little bit, right? That popcorn is going to cool off, but you have to hold on to that initial popping feeling because that is going to get you through to the end. And that is what is going to pull you to where you need to be. So your soul is going to pull you. Your ego is going to feel like you have to push, right? Your soul pulls, your ego pushes. So just remember that you should feel like you're being initially pulled to that thing that you want. All right, you guys have the most amazing holiday season, sending you so much love and until next time, earn your happy. Bye everyone. Thank you guys so much for spending this time with me on the earn your happy podcast. I am so glad that you stopped by. If you could take one second to share this episode with someone you think would love it, that would be absolutely amazing and we would be forever grateful. Also, please leave us a review if you feel so moved by going to iTunes and leaving us an honest thought, an honest comment. Tell us what you think. Tell us what you want to hear more of. It would really help us out on our journey to helping thousands and thousands of people. Until then, don't forget to earn your happy. Thanks again, guys. Bye-bye. Hey, all I'm so excited to share with you, Earn Your Happy is now part of Growth Day Podcast Network. A bunch of us are coming together to bring more growth to the world and support shows and brands that we truly believe in. And one of my friends is also on the network, and I'd love for you to go subscribe to his show. You guys, Trent Shelton has the most incredible podcast. It's called Straight Up with Trent Shelton, and it's going to remind you that you are built for this. I have heard Trent speak in person multiple times. I've listened to his podcast a ton. He's coming on the show and I literally cannot wait because this man just spits straight fire. It is like truth that goes to your core and makes you take action right away. If you want one of those podcasts that when you're just out on a walk, you can't help but want to start running and run through a wall in your life, this is the show to go listen to. So you guys make sure that you go subscribe to the show straight up with Trent Shelton. You're going to love it.
Hey, do you know what the big secret is this year? And it shouldn't be a secret because this should be your biggest focus. It is building your community. I am always working on building and nurturing my community and everyone is talking about the power of community. Without an online community, you just cannot grow organically or create a real movement, which is what I know that we're all after. And you can build trust or monetize your audience. When you get community right, not only does your audience grow faster, but so do your sales. But where's everybody gonna be managing their communities these days? And a lot of online entrepreneurs and thought leaders are turning to circle.so. Circle is an all-in-one community platform. It lets you host content and create discussions, live streams, group chats, and memberships all under your own brand. And what's so cool about Circle.so is that you don't even need a website or Facebook group. Instead, Circle lets you build your own community site where you can host content and manage your members. You can even create locked and unlocked content spaces, groups, and classes. How freaking cool is that? You can put your content behind a paywall too, and you can charge different amounts of money for different spaces on your community site. Circle.so is famously easy to use, and it has a free 14-day trial for you, so you can go check it out, see if you like it, see if you love all the options. Just go to circle.so. Go check it out right now, you guys. Imagine being able to manage your community, start group chats and live classes, and accept payments all in one place. Kind of mind-blowing since this is usually spread all over the place. You have to log into so many different things. If this is the year to capture, organize, and monetize your community, head over to circle.so. You can get a free trial and start building your online community right now. Just go to circle.so. You guys, you get the 14 day free trial. So just go and see if it's for you. It's going to streamline everything and make your life so much easier. It's so freaking cool. Hey, I know if you're listening to this podcast that you have big dreams and big goals. And one of the things that can really stop you is struggling with your marketing. Trust me, I have been there. Are you using 10 different systems just to build your online business? Then I want you to try Kajabi. Kajabi helps you build your web pages, set up funnels, and sell your courses, content, coaching, or communities. You've been hearing me talk a lot about funnels on this podcast and the importance of your email list. You can get a free trial at kajabi.com. That's K-A-J-A-B-I.com. I've talked about Kajabi before, but here's something that's super cool and new. They just rolled out an AI assistant for creating your online course curriculum. And this means you just type in a topic that you want to create on a course or webinar and bam, it's just generates a sample outline for you. It takes a ton of the hard work away. Of course, you're going to customize it to be your own, but this really helps you get over the struggle of how in the world to start which is where most people stop. If you're like me, starting is always the hardest part and that's what makes Kajabi so popular. They've made it easier for creators to build web pages, build courses, build coaching programs, build membership sites, build checkout pages, and build email funnels. So if you're struggling with any of those, you gotta go check it out. Go to kajabi.com. Kajabi was really the first all-in-one system and is trusted by over 100,000 creators. I think that's good enough for me. Also as influencers and marketers use this and now their smart ai platform makes it easy to take what you know and turn it into an online course and business go start building with a free trial at kajabi.com that's k-a-j-a-b-i.com